And Christine, a very emotional night here for dozens of teachers. They are fighting for their very jobs. They've been on an unpaid leave now for almost two weeks after defying the school board and its mandate to get vaccinated or else. Look here. Freedom! It's the emotional fallout of vaccine mandates as the Hacienda La Puente Unified School District now enforces its own order, putting dozens of unvaccinated teachers on unpaid leave. It's completely unbelievable. I, I, so, you know, some days I'm absolutely lost for words, and thankfully we've got all these wonderful people who are so supportive for us um, and our families, but it's been... It's been a, a very difficult last 10 days, for sure. These other people are fighting for their jobs. These people, took, they take care of our kids on a daily basis, you know, and they're ignoring us. They're ignoring us. They're shutting us out. It, it's, I'm extremely angry. <laughs> It's day 10 without pay for dozens of teachers, custodians, and other workers in the school district who all stand by their religious beliefs, filing exemptions not to be vaccinated, only to, as they claim, have their religious rights ignored by the school board. We're all on unpaid leave right now, so yes, they're, they're basically not giving us another choice, and it's discrimination against our religious beliefs, really. The unpaid workers pack into the school board meeting, but there is no change in the district's original order, which required employees to be vaccinated by October 15th or face being put on leave without pay. That is other school districts in the Southland now starting to enforce their own vaccine mandates. Here at the Granada Hills Charter High School, the punishment for refusing to be vaxxed even more severe. Seven workers now have been fired from their jobs. A counselor and six teachers now terminated, all vowing to file a lawsuit. While back here at Hacienda La Puente Unified, they have lawyered up too and are now just hoping and waiting to get back to work. Because we're all ready. We're just literally waiting for that call, come back to work, and we're there. We will do all of the, the um, same testing and um, wearing the mask and the whole bit, everything that we need to do to keep our kids safe because they are our number one priority. Now, a lot of the teachers say they will do whatever it takes, saying they'll get tested, they'll wear a mask. Stopping short, though, they will not get vaccinated, standing by their religious beliefs. The school district, for its part, out with a statement saying it is standing by its order, citing information from the Centers for Disease Control and the L.A. County Health Department, saying all of those agencies saying the vaccine is safe and effective, so the standoff goes on in this district. For now, we're live here in the City of Industry. Ed Lasky goes back to both of you. And many religious leaders have said the exact same thing. Ed, thank you so much. More